Yo, what's poppin'? YouTube is Paul Mike here, back with another video. So today I got you guys with the best center build in 2K24. If you're creating this center build, you can shoot, you can dunk. Now this name is like, its name is like two-way mid-range threat, but like I know it's a two-way and stuff, but I can shoot threes too. Max out on threes has like shy contact dunks and stuff, so it goes crazy. We have like most of the dribble move as a big man, the best center build on 2K24. Just follow me step by step and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. We're grinding 2K24, so yeah, just be OG and subscribe. And we're trying to get 5K subscribers and let's get right into the video. Now, hands doesn't really matter. Just remember, again, it's your choice, it's your preference. That doesn't really matter. Now, hands, honestly, you guys can make it a left-handed person. It's like, it doesn't really matter, but it's your choice. Again, if you're trying to shoot left-hand, defense won't really expect that. Now, position, this really matters. Just follow me step by step. I'll give you guys different ways of making this build. Uh, different ways to, to fill your play style, right? Now, you guys can make a power forward or a small forward. No, no, don't make, you can make a small forward, but I highly do not recommend it because you can make a small forward 6'10". The height is going to be 6'10". But we're focusing on interior defense, on the blocks, no rebounding, no, not much of the perimeter defense. So small forward would be the less likely option. The best one would be center. You can make it power forward though. Center is probably better because we focus more on the interior defense. 6'10". Wingspan, I'm gonna put it not to the, wait, don't max it out, but put it to 7'7". Uh, 7'7", seven, 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 wingspan, right? Now, weight, we would need the speed, but also we need XO. Well, when you lower it, I put it 224. Why? I didn't want to lower it too much because we need an 84 strength. We need maxed out strength. I'll tell you guys because we the 84 strength is gonna get y'all all the badge you guys need for defense and finishing. So right here, 224 would be perfect. And also we got the speed and also some uh like speed with the ball and stuff would increase. So this right here would be the perfect weight. And this is the wingspan as it seven seven and just press continue. Now we you guys gotta find me step by step. Starting off, I told you guys. We're gonna, it's a, it's a mid-range, but like it's a, it's a two-way mid-range threat, whatever it is. We're gonna max out the midi right there. Not only that, we're gonna max out the three-pointer right there, giving us a, a solid three-pointer. Now, this boat can play defense and stuff. It can also dunk, it can do everything, but also on the three-pointer goes crazy. Corner specialist, catch a shoot, you could be a popper. You also got dead eye and stuff. That means you have also agreement she guard up and stuff. Why? Because we're gonna have a decent amount of ball handling. We're gonna have dribble moves unlocked at the 6'10", right? We go crazy. We have 75 speed, uh, no, 75. 75 ball handling with speed with ball, we're gonna have a decent amount. We're gonna have killer combos too. So moving on, let's start off with let's go to the playmaker now. I'll tell you guys step by step what you guys need. Don't max it out. Actually, you can max it out, right? Just put it 75. That's all you need. You can max it out. It's gonna save a natural. Put it 75. Keep it solid because we need killer combos, which we're gonna lock at 75 right there from 74 to 75. We're gonna get blow by, we're gonna get physical handles, we're gonna get big driver. Most of them on gold. Watch out, we're not done with the build. Not only that we're gonna have unpluckable upgraded because we're gonna get post control at 86, so we're gonna lock the unpluckable on silver. Now, speed with the ball again. That way that you put the 67. Just follow me step by step. These attributes are unlocked now. You know what I'm saying? I told you guys big driver. I mean blow by is gonna be unlocked. Now the thing is, it's like big drivers on bronze and stuff, right? You might say, wait, we don't need that. Like it's too small. Once we upgrade the physical style of this build, it's gonna go crazy with it. Like it's gonna like have gold, uh, big driver, unpluckable up there. Now pass accuracy. We're gonna have to do with 60. I know it's a small, I'll give you guys a different leeway later on, but we're gonna have diamond and replay faster. That's all we need. As of right now, as of right now, I'll tell you guys a different way making the build. And let's go with finishing. Cause right here, post control is gonna help you on the shooting too. Cause at 85, 86, 86, 86. Mm, 86, 85, keep it 85. Cause it's not gonna, yeah, 85. keep it 85 right here, right here. And right there is gonna give us uh, a pluckable on silver as I told you guys, post fade phenomenon. That means you could be fading away from anywhere. And also, uh, back down will be a will be a lot when we get the strength. So you know, we can back down people. You feel me? I know you probably came in for that. You're gonna back down people. And once again, 92 standing dunk. That means if you're posting up, you get the contact that you guys need. 92 standing dunk. I'm pretty sure we'll unlock Shaq and stuff. Not only that, I said 92 driving dunk, right? Right here, giving you fast twitch, position dunker, and also gonna have rise up another badge. It's gonna be on gold too. Watch out, because we don't got vertical. When we get vertical, it's gonna be on gold. Driving dunk. Yes, we're a big man, but we're gonna have a very solid driving dunk. Most driving dunk at a 70 will be solid. You're gonna have the Giannis driving dunk. So you're gonna be able to have a decent amount of driving dunk. I know this boot does not do driving, but you got the standing up crazy and also driving dunk. Now, driving layup and uh, close shot, put both at a 60. It's gonna lock some like smasher and stuff, badge and stuff. And also like a decent amount of layups. Now we don't get it. We're not going for driving layups. We're trying to be more of a post-core in the paint. We're gonna have defense. We're gonna have the strength. We're gonna have the vertical. 
Now, yeah, vertical, we're gonna go crazy with it. 80 vertical, we're gonna see them. And tier defense put it to 85. 85 and tier defense is very solid for a 610. Now, anchor stuff is not unlocked because we didn't unlock it right here. We're gonna have chase down and stuff. Upgrade blocks to 87 right there. Not too much, 87 will get you anchor on silver. Chase down, I'm pretty sure on this build is gonna be on gold. I, I tried to make it a Hall of Fame. I, I did make it a Hall of Fame, but it's gonna mess up the shooting and stuff. So keep this on gold. We're gonna, have, we're gonna have it on gold, chase down on gold. And I'll explain you benefits and stuff. Now, rebounding, just put it to 85, a defense rebound. Once we have the 85 defense rebound, we don't need that much of obviously rebound, so just keep it to 75 at least. So balancing it out together. I know like for some people it's like, oh wait, you gotta balance out. You could both put it, you could both put this to an 80, but that's not gonna give you rebound chase around silver, right? It's gonna make it unbalanced. So might as well see up the attributes and put this to 75 and make this 85. Now you're gonna have uh, rebound chaser on this side, right? You feel me? So it's like, would you value the badge or attributes? It's your choice, but you can make both at an 80, giving you rebound chaser on bronze, or 75, 85, giving you rebound chaser on silver, also helping you on uh, offensive rebound, so getting a silver, uh, getting a silver defense, getting a silver rebound chaser. Now, speed, you can have that at 70, right there. It's gonna get you the chase down you guys need. We're not done though, we're not done. 61 XO, right there, giving you the Big driver on Hall of Fame. That's your goal? Now it's a Hall of Fame. Increase the chance for a bull by when attacking to the basket. That means if people are playing tight, you go for that drive with that big driver and also get that standing dog you guys need. If not, you know, you could check in an open shot. You know what I'm saying? I would hope that you was checking it if you've been watching this video. And if you are new, don't forget to like and subscribe if you are right here. And strength, we're gonna put it to it. Max it out. Matter of fact, not that I put it something. Max it out, giving you physical handles right here when we go to speed with ball. No, that's people about uh, ball handling. We're gonna have big drivers, as you guys can see. And also, physical handles. Physical handles is really good because when you go for a drive, you can like push around people and stuff. So this badge is already good. It's an eight-tip badge, so, you know, assess it itself. Vertical, we're gonna have that to 80. 80 vertical, again, rise up is up there. Now 80, give you chase down on gold. Now, I don't know how crazy this is. Chase down and anchor as a big man is crazy because most big men don't have chase down. Why? You need 80 vertical. Big men don't really have that much vertical, right? Not only that, you need 70 speed or somewhere in the 70s for speed, right? So chase it down, you're not really gonna have that much. It's a unique badge for you guys to have, you know what I'm saying? It's an additional badge. Max out stamina for the sake of it, and you know, not need stamina, you know what I'm saying? But the build is not done too. I'll give you guys leeways mostly for you guys to, you know, play around with it and stuff. Especially for pass accuracy. I know people are gonna come from you to pass accuracy. People who play rec are gonna come. If you guys wanna play rec, sacrifice, um, Hmm, what, what would you sacrifice a little bit of standing dunk? Because we took a huge amount of standing dunk, right? You know, we could make it somewhere in the 80. Keep it fast to show silver, 82 would be solid. And this will give you leeway for free throws and pass accuracy. You could have free throws all the way up, which I do not need, 94. But if you're playing rec, you probably need it. So put this to a 59 again, 59 and max it out. Or you could, play, you could put it to pass accuracy, giving you 89, which again, this is the leeway you I told, I told you guys at the end, if you follow me step by step. Now, me personally, it's my personal preference, but it's like, you just need Dimer, that's all you need, right? If you're playing record stuff, yes, it makes sense, but if not, just put Dimer on, get your standing dunk up there, and put the rest to whatever you guys want, maybe like, maxed out spiraling, maxed out, mm, it's not gonna make any difference. Maybe the offensive rebound, maybe, yeah, probably put it to the offensive rebound, and right there, this is the build. If you enjoy this type of build videos, this is the best center build. If you have any modification, you guys can put in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe once again. We're trying to get 5K subscribers. And yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm out.